everyone. Hope you're doing well. Today is June 19th, 2020. I can't believe it's already June. This year, half the year is gone. The year 2020, this year has been eventful with all the coronavirus, COVID-19, lockdown, shelter in place, and the racial tension, the protests, and the, all that has been going on. So uh, anyway, the topic of this video blog, and I've been creating some video blogs and audio blogs and uh, written blogs, uh, just short thought sharing sessions for two to three minutes. So today I wanted to talk about something which everyone wants to achieve. I guess everyone. Uh, wants to achieve or wants to be, which is happiness. I guess everyone wants to be happy. I remember reading about the British uh, musician, philosopher, poet, John Lennon, when, uh, from Beatles, when he was uh, in elementary school, I think the teacher asked all the kids, all the students to write what they wanted to be when they grew up. And the other kids wrote things like being a doctor or engineer or a lawyer or a bus driver or whatever it is. But John Lennon wrote, uh, be happy. So which is actually the bottom line, right? Everybody wants to be happy. Now, how to be happy is a big question. Everybody wants to be happy, but nobody is happy because they do not know how to be happy. And I don't have the answer either, but I'm just saying there are certain things which there was actually a TED talk that I um, recently watched and I'll put the link. Um, uh, so it's kind of uh, contradictory to what we usually think. And <clears throat> it came as a surprise that what makes you happy is actually being vulnerable so people do not want to be vulnerable right you don't want to be exposed or you want don't want to be uh, unprotected so uh, vulnerable being vulnerable means you are opening yourself up to what you feel being sad or angry or you know shame or self-conscious or any such feeling but being vulnerable it seems from research actually makes you happier so the more you put walls around you and protect yourself to make yourself happy is actually making yourself unhappy uh, this uh, there was a ted talk and i will put the link it is by um, a lady named Brené Brown, and I would recommend you watch it. And she t did the research and she talks about it. And it's actually something which even the Eastern philosophies talk about, which is um, you know, the more you come into flow with your environment and be part of everything, be connected, which is again yoga, being connected. Uh, so it, it all joins together in some form. So being yourself will actually make you happy and being vulnerable. And so it means you take risks that you are not playing it safe. You are doing things which come from your heart it means it might make you uncomfortable uncomfortable sometimes it might make you feel exposed but it is also being authentic so being authentic and true to yourself is being vulnerable and being vulnerable actually makes you happier anyway that was a 
hopefully a short talk and hopefully meaningful. Thank you very much. Namaste. Bye.